Offutt Air Force Base, Neb, the chief of U.S. Strategic Command said Thursday that the size, yield and other indications seen in North Korea's most recent nuclear test equates to a hydrogen bomb, and that he must now assume Pyongyang can build one. Air Force Gen. John Hyden, who oversees U.S. nuclear forces and monitors North Korea, told reporters meeting with him at his headquarters on this installation that he cannot confirm a hydrogen bomb was tested but the test was significant because of the sheer destruction and damage you can use and create with a weapon of that size. The September 3rd blast is believed to have been at least 100 kilotonnes in size, large enough to reshape the size of the mountain above the test site that Pyongyang used. The change from the original atomic bomb to the hydrogen changed our entire deterrent relationship with the Soviet Union, Haydn said. It is significantly of concern not just to strategic command but to everybody in the free world. It should be of concern to people in the neighborhood, which is Japan and Korea, as well as China and Russia. Haydn said that if North Korea can mount a bomb of that size on a missile, it could potentially destroy a city. The United States has the ability to deter a nuclear attack on itself or its allies because of the nuclear weapons it maintains, but it's a different question whether America can stop North Korea from building them.